stars had to align and come together. All right, so I've already got this guy's face. Show you. Face and one ear uh, being tracked. So there it is in forward and reverse. So uh, we're going to do the last ear here. And what I'm doing basically is I'm masking out his face and ears so that the effect, the special effect that I have on this scene will not apply in this area. Um, the special effect in this case being like glittery stars. Um, all right, so we got that sort of as a base. So we're going to just track. It's basically looking frame by frame for um, a pattern. And it's just going to automatically track that out. Perfect. So now we can see we've got his face being tracked. I might do the neck. Actually, yeah, let's go ahead and do the neck. Um, it could probably be a square. Eh, no. Uh, let's see. The square looked like it had feather, which I will need. Um, I don't know how to feather this. Can we just do that portion of his neck? But same idea, roughly. Okay, that's uh, let's oh, that's fine. Start in the middle. Whoops, sorry. Track it forward and then track it backwards. All right, and we can track it backwards. Hmm, got a little wonky at the end here. So we'll just clean that up, track that back forward, and we should be good. Might have to touch that corner up too. Yeah, see how they're overlapped there? That looks good. So we'll go back and fix that. Um, yeah, I'm going to pull this. Pull it down below his collar there. I'm gonna pull that up a bit. Okay. Let's track that forward, and then we should be good. Just trying to minimize. Oh yeah, that looks great. So. Perfect. So anything inside that red will be excluded. So close out of there. Right now you can see it's only in that area. <laughs> uh, it's cool. You can see. That's essentially the thing that I just cut out. So we're going to invert it. And now. Stars that do align and come together. 